but I just thoroughly enjoy the challenges that come with it and what I get up and get to do each day. So I've been working for Fairbrother for 18 years now. I started as an apprentice, I did my four years of my apprenticeship. Then I went straight into being a leading hand after I finished that because I was very keen and wanted to step up straight away. And then I went to sub foreman, um, did a period of time where I lived in Queensland. And then they took on a project that I couldn't say no to. They rang me and said, will you come back and help us run this? And the rest is history. I went from sub foreman to foreman to site manager to where I am today. So I thoroughly enjoy what we do and the different projects we take on. My time in Queensland really was an eye-opener for me. I worked for a different construction company up there and the safety culture, the way that Fairbrother looks after its employees, there's a range of different reasons why Fairbrother is the best employer that I've worked for. I hear other stories of people that have worked for other companies and you know they don't compare to Fairbrother. We do set the bar in everything that we do, whether it be quality, safety, um, so it's part of my enjoyment to just work with the best and give my little bit into the company as well. And the challenges that come with each project, I, I just don't think I can ever see myself getting bored of what I do, like going from doing Glebe Hill Shopping Centre that's a you know, $20 million shopping centre to doing Austin's Ferry Primary School which is just a really architectural primary school. The end result was just a, an unreal school that looks even fantastic to this day, like I drive past it all the time and go, oh, that still looks great. It's those opportunities to work on that once a lifetime project. And who knows what net one next project might look like. It could be a 10 story building in the middle of town. Especially if you're doing an apprenticeship, make sure you take the time and to, to learn, learn well. Make the most of those four years because they'll set you up for life. If there's a range of different items that you could go off and do with your life, um, as long as you spend those first couple of years working hard and, and learning as much as you can. So that would be my advice to any young whippersnapper starting out is have a crack, yeah.